Hello guys welcome back to the channel i hope you all are doing extremely fine my name is prince and you are watching the tech stream in this video i am going to show you a full 90 fps bgmi gaming review on the royce roid android 13 custom rom on my oneplus 8t so without wasting any more time let's get started so i have been trying out the new royce roid rom based on android 13 and today we will be testing the gaming performance of this rom i have already made a review video about the same so feel free to check that video out also comment down if you want me to make an installation video about the same now this rom has an option in settings called unlock higher fps in games and once you enable this option you your device will run maximum possible refresh rate in games and if i open up bgmi you can see that the game is running on full 90 fps and this is going to work for all devices like oneplus 8 series and oneplus 9r so let me show you the graphic settings real quick i am playing on smooth and 90 fps graphic and so now i'm going to play for 30 40 minutes and i will show you how this rom performs I'll also be using the Ampere app for temps and you can see currently the temp is around 20.7 degrees. I will also enable 1080p screen recording which will again be heavy for the device and we will be able to see how this device performs in extreme conditions. We'll be playing 3 games, one 8v8 TDM, then one 8v8 Arena and then one v 8 TDM again. So let's start with the 8v8 Arena match. The battery is around 81% and the temp is around 20.7 degrees. After the first 8v8 game, the temps rose to 32.7 degrees while the battery dropped to 76 degrees. However, the game was pushing 90 fps without any lags and frame drops. Honestly, moving on, let's play one 8v8. After the 8v8 arena, the battery dropped by 5% to 71 and the temps also rose to 39.2 degrees. The FPS were again full 90 FPS with 1080p screen recording and let's play one last 8v8 TDM again. After this TDM game, the battery dropped to 67% and the temps were around 42.6 degrees. The gameplay was very smooth again. So after almost 30 minutes of gaming, the battery dropped by 13%. The temps were somewhere around 39 to 40 degrees, which is not much to be honest. And I was also doing 1080p screen recording the whole time, but still no frame drops or lags to be seen. Even after all these scenarios, the ROM has really performed well and I was able to get 90 FPS consistently. The performance is even better than Oxygen OS 13 and Color OS 12. If you are someone who wants to do gaming seriously, definitely try out this rom comment down if you want more videos like this subscribe to the channel for more tech videos thank you for watching <laughs>